So many women don't know exactly when they're ovulating, they're missing the signs, or they're going by an app which isn't exactly telling you your actual ovulation date because it can't, because it's only a computer. You need to know the natural signs of your body and it's good to measure your LH levels as well. I'm going to explain more about ovulation in this video so you can really get in tune with your body and also really know when exactly that time is when you are ovulating. Hi, I'm Vicky from Oh My Mama Body. I really love helping you to be able to understand your body and the natural symptoms that are going on so that you really feel confident in yourself. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for watching my video today. A warm welcome and please do subscribe to get even more really helpful videos. Perhaps you're trying to get pregnant. Perhaps you're not trying to get pregnant. Whichever way, it is so important that you know when you are ovulating for both reasons. Some of you don't want to get pregnant, some of you do. So you need to know what time of the month is really the great time to either be using protection or not using protection. And this is your fertile window. This is when you are ovulating. And please know we're not all average. We all ovulate at different times. Some of us ovulate really early on in our cycles, some in the middle and some really late, just before your period. Um, and it can get really confusing because we are told that the average is bang on in the middle of our cycle, which just isn't true because we're not all average, like I just said. And if you're using an app, it will only estimate when you are ovulating. Unless you are truly measuring your LH levels, then you're not really going to know exactly. Unless you know the natural symptoms of your body, then you're not going to know. So let's start with the natural symptoms. This is really helpful to know the natural symptoms. Things like egg white cervical mucus. You really notice that change in cervical mucus when you're around your time of ovulation. Now, some of us get that type of cer cervical mucus before we ovulate, some of us during and some of us after. But just watch out for when that is happening, okay? Because then you know you're ovulating around that time could be anything between one to three days. Other things, you feeling really in the mood, your body is releasing hormones that are saying, hey, now's the time, now's the time, you will need to get pregnant now because I'm just releasing an egg for you. <laughs> you may even notice um, that feeling when your follicle actually releases the egg. It could feel a bit crampy on one side. Some ladies also notice their temperature because your temperature goes slightly down and then up again around the time of ovulation. It's such a fine drop and then rise, really fine. Um, but if you're measuring it, you will notice. But some women do feel slightly warmer around the time of ovulation as well. I do have another great video which explains everything in more detail. So do follow the link that comes above the screen and go and watch that video when you get to the end of this one. It really helps you to understand your body better and to know when you're ovulating. It's so good to know the natural symptoms that your body is giving you. Now, the other thing you can do is measure. You can measure using ovulation strips, which are fine. You can keep tracking and noticing when the second line gets darker and really see when that time is that your luteinizing hormone, your LH hormone, is really high. Now that LH hormone is the time leading up to your ovulation. So just before your egg gets released, that LH hormone is at its peak. And so you know, okay, now I'm really close to ovulation. Now, you can also use electronic advices, which are really great because they give you an exact number they give the exact data of what is in your urine, the concentration of that LH hormone, which means you can really accurately measure when you're getting close to that peak and your egg being released. I really recommend using the Mira Fertility app for this because it is so accurate. And if you are really trying to get pregnant, then you really want the most accurate data out there. 
There's a link below to how you can get the Mira app for yourself. I do have a wonderful discount code that you can use, so go ahead and check out that link. There's also a blog about it on my website, so go and have a read because it's really great when you know more about this and can really understand when your body is ovulating. So I really hope that's helped you today to help you understand your body that a little bit better. Please do go and check out my website for more information because it's really helpful for you. And you're most welcome to come and join my Facebook group, Mama Meets and Midwife. Again, everything is down in the video description. You just open up the arrows here and here, pop down and check out all of the links that I've put in there for you. And I really look forward to hearing from you. Wishing you all the best on your journey. Bye for now.